Subtracting two to three digit numbers without regrouping. Please answer the equation to problem in the word. What is the difference of 425 and 310? When subtracting without regrouping, in what place value will you start? Subtraction of large numbers without regrouping is easy. You can start from the ones or from the hundreds digits. What is important is the alignment of the digits belonging to the same place value position from the mini wins to the difference. Let us study the following example. Len has 15 flowers. Yuriko received 10 flowers from Len. Len has only 5 flowers left. We can also subtract 10 from 15 in vertical form. Here's how. Align the digits belonging to the same place value point. This is our place value chart. 5 is in the 1's place and 1 in the 10's place. 0 in the 1's place and 1 in the 10's place. We will subtract 10 from 15. So 5 minus 0 is equal to 5. Since 1 is equal to 1, then 1 minus 1 is equal to 0. It's okay not to put 0. Because zero is a placeholder. Therefore, there are five flowers left to land. We can also subtract three digit numbers. Remember that digits in the same place value position must be aligned. Let's try to subtract 103 from 226. This is our place value chart. 226. 6 is in the 1's place. 2 is in the 10's place. And 2 is in the 100's place. 103. 3 is in the 1's place, and 0 is in the 10's place, and 1 is in the 100's place. So first, we will subtract 3 from 6. So 6 minus 3 is equal to 3. Then, 2 minus 0 is equal to 2. 2 minus 1 is equal to 1. Therefore, the difference between 226 and 
130 is 123. Hundred twenty six is the mean you win. One hundred three is the subtrahend, and one hundred twenty three is the difference. Remember the names of numbers in a subtraction sentence. To check. Add the difference to the subtrahend. If their sum is equal to the minuit, then the difference is correct. Since the sum is equal to the minuit, then the difference is correct. Answer the following problems. Last year, there were 850 pupils in our school. Now, there are 974 pupils. How much less were the pupils last year than this year? Here's the solution. 974 minus 850 4 minus 0 is equal to 4 7 minus 5 is equal to 2 9 minus 8 is equal to 1 Therefore, less 124 pupils last year than this year. There are 179 grade 2 pupils and 148 grade 3 pupils. How many more are the grade 2 pupils? than the grade 3 pupils. 179 minus 148. We will subtract 148 from 179. 9 minus 8 is equal to 1. 7 Minus 4 is equal to 3. 1 minus 1 is equal to 0. It's okay not to put the 0 because 0 is a placeholder. Of the 264 grade 1 pupils who enrolled this year, 51 are Homeschooled. How many children are not homeschooled? We will subtract 51 from 264. 4 minus 1 is equal to 3. 6 minus 5 is equal to 1. Since no digit aligned in the two, so we will bring down the two. Therefore, there were 230 children are not homeschooled. There are 386 grade 5 and 6 pupils who enrolled this year. 240 of them are girls. How many are boys? Here's the solution. We will subtract 240 from 386. 
6 minus 0 is equal to 6. 8 minus 4 is equal to 4. 3 minus 2 is equal to 1. Therefore, 146 are boys. Two hundred sixty-three pupils who enrolled this year are new pupils. If the total number of pupils in our school is nine hundred seventy-four, how many pupils are old pupils? We will subtract two hundred sixty-three from nine hundred seventy-four. 4 minus 3 is equal to 1. 7 minus 6 is equal to 1. 9 minus 2 is equal to 7. Therefore, 711 are all pupils. Now, let's try to solve for Minuit. To solve for Minuit, we will add 18 and 16. 8 plus 6 is equal to 14. Carry 1 and we will add 1 plus 1. Plus 1 is equal to 3. So the menu width is 34. If we will subtract 18 from 34, the difference is 16. Here's another example. Again, to solve the minuit, we will add 23 and 41. 3 plus 1 is equal to 4. 2 plus 4 is equal to 6. So the minuit is 64. If we will subtract 23 from 64, the difference is 41. Now, let's try to compute for the subtrahend. To compute for the subtrahend, we will subtract the difference from the menu window. Nine minus seven is equal to two. Three minus one is equal to two. Four minus three is equal to one. Therefore, the subtrahend is one hundred twenty-two. If we subtract one hundred twenty-two from four hundred thirty-nine. The difference is 370. Again, if we compute for the subtrahend, we will subtract the difference from the minuit. 3 minus 2 is equal to 1. 4 minus 1 is equal to 3. And 5 minus 4 is equal to 1. Therefore, the subtrahend is 131. If we subtract 131 from 543, the difference is 
412. Now, let's solve for the difference. Remember, if the sum of the difference and the subtrahend is equal to the minuit, then the difference is correct. Thank you for listening. You may now proceed to your next task. Goodbye.